whether you're dabbling in oud for the first time, or are an oudept connoisseur, likely the first thing you've heard about oxidation is that it's an oud's sworn enemy. But here's how to make it your friend. You've got to understand the context. Oxidation isn't good when storing an oud for a long period of time, but it's your best friend when actually wearing an oud. The process can be harnessed to bring out the nuances of an oil. And letting an oil breathe a bit before application can heighten the profile and your overall experience of the oil. Samples are a perfect example of this. A sample, when coming directly from the source, has been allowed to breathe for only as long as it takes to reach you and you take to put it on. This short blossoming process is mild oxidation, allowing the sample to open up a bit. Samples are available to experience the vast scent spectrum which Ansar Oud encompasses. So here's how you can harness oxidation and tame that beast of an Oud to be just the way you like it. Use the applicator from the source bottle to decant a few days worth of Oud into the sample vial and allow it to breathe a while before applying. To expedite the process, lay the sample vial on its side, increasing the surface area exposed to the air in the vial. Uncork it from time to time until the profile matches your taste, similar to how connoisseurs decant their vintage reds. This process allows the buildup of metaphorical tannins to escape and the flavors of the oud to blossom. But just as you can cork a vintage bottle of red, over-oxidation isn't a good thing. And when storing or aging oud for extended periods of time, source bottles should be tightly sealed and stored upright in a cool environment, away from areas subject to drastic fluctuations in temperature to preserve the efficacy of the oud. To best preserve samples of 0.15 grams and up, Keep your vials upright and sealed. Resist the urge to frequently crack them open and smell them, which introduces fresh, unsaturated air to further oxidize the oil. Samples are especially prone to oxidation because they contain a larger air-to-oil ratio within the vial. When you purchase samples from Ansar Oud, in most cases they're decanted the same day they ship, so you're getting an Oud as close to its source profile as possible. If buying an oud from a reseller, be sure to find out when the sample was decanted and their storage practices, such as how the vials are stored, whether upright or in their box, and how frequently they were opened. But as a rule of thumb, when those complimentary gift samples come in your order, apply them right away and experience the oud as it was meant to be experienced. Thanks for your time, everyone. If you found this tip helpful, be sure to share it with your friends and fellow fragrance lovers with the utmost appreciation.